Hi guys, welcome back to Conversion Chef YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be talking about a Chrome extension slash application that would make your life easier, especially if you're into dropshipping. So if you want to know more, just tune in. So Shopmaster is one of the best Google Chrome extensions for dropshipping that allows you to directly import products from multiple suppliers to your online store. So there's no more hassle needed to scrape out products from one store to another. So with this extension, you can easily automate the scraping process and engage with more prospects. So here are a couple of things that Shopmaster allows. So it goes with product sourcing, auto fulfillment, and product monitor. So we will be tackling more about these as we move on with this video. So because of the range of features it offers, it's quite popular among advanced dropshippers. So the more you advance in your dropshipping tasks, the more useful this tool becomes. So in this video, we will be using Shopmaster to import products from AliExpress. But with this app or extension, you can also import products from other platforms like Amazon, eBay, Shopee, CJ Dropshipping, and many more. So now let's see how to import products from AliExpress. But first things first, of course, you need to install Shopmaster and sign up for an account. So don't worry, that would be a very easy and fast process. Afterwards, you can already use the extension. So let's go to AliExpress. So for example, your niche is on pet and you would like to sell a pet bed to your online store. So what you will do, just search for the pet bed in AliExpress and there will be many products on the search result. So to use Shopmaster, of course, just go to your Chrome extensions and click Shopmaster. So in here, you can also set a filter. Filter the shipping carrier if you would like an e-packet carrier. So there are many options here. Just scroll on these and see which suits best your goals. Second one is your delivery country if you ship on United States, UK, or anywhere else across the globe. You also have here the free shipping only video available and hide and qualified product so if you change something on these filters just click update filter now the search result will show of course with these filters that you have set okay so these products has no e-packet so just scroll around these and see find those products that have e-packet so let's not waste our time there Let's say that or let's assume that this product has an e-packet. So let's say that you have already inspected or evaluated this product and you would like to import this to your online store. So you, as you can see, you have here an import product button on the lower right. So this one. So to import the product to your Shopmaster dashboard or import list, just click on this button. So this product has already been imported. This is also a great feature of Shopmaster because you cannot, there is no way that you would duplicate an imported product already. So just skip this. And let's see another one. Let's say pet toys. Okay, let's assume again that this, ha this has e-packet. Okay, and import product. So afterwards, it will show you here the imported products. Just go there. And you will be directed to the Shopmaster dashboard. So these are the imported products that you have imported from AliExpress or anywhere else. So here are the different products. So this is the latest. So to edit this one, just click on this edit icon. So this is also one of the great features of Shopmaster because you can already edit the product on this page so you can edit the product name your description 
So very user friendly, the images and the specifics. So if you are done, just click save. Of course, just like other platforms, this is not yet imported to your store or shown on your online store. So to do that, just click on import to store. So you can import it to your store. For me, it's Shopify. So you can just go to your account and connect your Shopify store. Shopify key and publish. So it has already been published because as you can see it is so it is already marked as an active product as you can see here on the right. Now let's go and check our online store. Catalog. So here it is. It's already been shown or displayed on our online store. So what if I'm not using the Shopmaster extension? So to do that, just go to your Shopify and add Shopmaster dropshipping from the Shopify application store. So this is how the dashboard looked like. Now to import products, of course, just go to the sourcing and click dropshipping products. Now on the dropshipping products, these products displayed on the search results are not only from AliExpress. So we have different products from CJ Dropshipping, Amazon, AliExpress, Alibaba, and many more platforms. So let's check this one, just like this one. So as you can see, this product is from CJ Dropshipping. Now let's check another one, this. So it's also from CJ Dropshipping. Now, of course, you can also search products in this Shopmaster dashboard or ap application. So just like how you do it on AliExpress, just search for the products or search for a category. So for example, your niche is on home improvement. So we have here different products. Let's say we would like to select this one. So now it's from AliExpress. So you, you can see the difference here that there are products from AliExpress and products from CJ. So that is a great feature of Shopmaster because you don't have to jump from one platform to another like from AliExpress going to CJ Dropshipping or Alibaba. So in, with Shopmaster, it has already made this task easier for you. Now, of course, the, the process of importing products is similar when you use the extension. So, for example, you would like to sell this one. Just click to import. Now, it is already on your import list. So, it's already been listed on these products. So, to import it to your online store, just repeat the process that we have made earlier when we used the extension. So that's just how easy it is to import products from Shopmaster or from AliExpress, CJ Dropshipping, and other platforms using the Shopmaster Chrome extension and the Shopmaster application. So now that we know how to import products using Shopmaster, there are also different features of this application or a Chrome extension. So you have here the products. You can see here your different products, the active one, the draft, and the hidden products. As well as you can see the different orders or if you have orders, your recent orders to purchase and being shipped. So also, we have here the reports which shows you the overview and the sales performance of the different products that you have imported or listed on your Shopify store. So this is a great feature of this application because you'll be able to monitor the product's performance. Now you also have here your tools if you would like to manage your images, your PayPal, and the migrations. So those are basically the different features and use of Shopmaster 
Now, let's talk about the pros and cons of Shopmaster. So, what are the pros of Shopmaster? Number one, it has vast inventory of automation tools. We also have here the popularity among dropshippers. So, Shopmaster is really popular among dropshippers. And third is the effectively saves time so that you can focus on something more important. And the cons of Shopmaster is that the user interface is quite complex for new users. But since you have watched this video, of course, it is now easier for you to navigate this application. So that's it. That's everything about Shopmaster. I hope that you have learned something from this video like importing products and what are the different features of this application. So I hope to see you on the next one. Bye! Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like and share this video and we are happy to hear from you on the comment section. Visit our YouTube channel Conversion Chef for more videos about reviews of Shopify applications that can help you increase or boost your sales. You may also check the description below for the links of the applications and our mailing list. If you haven't subscribed yet, just hit that subscribe button as well as the bell to be notified with our new updates. I hope to see you on the next video. Bye!